donne le Thierry. As a knight himself, Sir Jean followed the strict rules of chivalry and was expected to protect the local peasantry and ensure peace. Pour votre service. Most medieval tournaments were friendly in nature, held for sport and glory, but the combat of the Thirty was arranged between opponents mired in war. English raids had torn through the countryside of Brittany and brought great hardship to the people. Sir Jean spotted an English raiding party attacking a nearby farmstead. The French knights defeated the English raiders and Sir Guy de Rochefort joined Sir Jean's party. Looking to secure his honor, a young knight held his ground on a bridge in Sir Jean's path. Honorably conceding defeat in the duel, Sir Yves Charel joined the cause. Sir Jean entered the staging area for the tournament, where he prepared to choose which knights would join him in battle. Each knight would be accompanied by his squires, young nobles in training to become knights themselves. Sir Jean had selected his champions. As the sun rose, the two sides entered the arena, ready for the first round of combat. The French were at a disadvantage following the first round, but they would use the break to strengthen their forces.
Quando je commande... Place, comme vous plaît. Soyez avant, compagnon. Avant, compagnon. Refreshed and reinvigorated, the French knights return to the arena for another round of combat. The combat of the Thirty was about to decide which nation would control the Duchy of Brittany. Triumphant, Sir Jean de Beaumanoir and his loyal 